morning, folks. Another snow last night. And uh, I heard some visitors outside. The dogs were barking differently. So I decided to come out and take a look around while I was doing chores. And uh, before I even got to that, first thing I noticed when I was doing chores is that I had this little visitor. See those tiny, tiny tracks? Um, my hand is this big for comparison. So someone went out that way. But, uh, maybe not so much of a visitor, because we followed tracks back. I think it came from right in there. So it's probably living under the chicken house. I uh, in that little hole. Maybe stealing my eggs. Uh, definitely was checking out the quail. Now, I don't know, um, because it snowed on top of that animal, and I'm not even that great with tracks anyhow, um, definitely came over here. Oh, definitely came around this way. Look at that. And then went, hung out here a little bit. So again, like, this is probably multiple tracks there. Not a cat. Not a dog, so it's not one of mine. But probably a little weasel. Now, I still have the appropriate number of quail. So, um, I don't think he came in to eat any. Everything's pretty, um, pretty, um, locked up from the outside. No one can get in there, no big cracks. Totally deliberate. But maybe he was eating, looking for mice that had come up from the field next door. And we're hiding under here. And there is a little bit of quail feed that comes out the cracks. So mice might come up and eat that. But that was um, that was the first visitor that I saw signs of this morning. We'll go look at the other one now. <laughs> you got it, Tia. You got your tail. Well done. The dogs are so happy that it's colder now. Okay, now... <laughs> I heard Thea barking, uh, maybe it was Avalu, someone was barking in a very, um, not in a way to keep something out that was already out, but in a way uh, where they were clearly trying to um, scare something away that was close by. And I came out this morning and I saw these. Too small to be a dog. Could be cat. The cat could have been out here this morning. He does that. But then over here, um, something was running. So uh, over here, something was, was going, walking towards the tree. And then over here, something came running out of the tree. And again, uh, too small to be a dog. Just... So, I was going to follow this back and see if I could figure out what was going on over here. So that's a dog print next to this other print. And you can see that the dog um, followed this trail and then it snowed on top of that a little bit. You can see that whatever it was was running around in there a little bit. And is that a set of prints here? Coming out this way? Hmm. Maybe. 
know where it would come from there, though. Excuse me. Oh. 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 Hmm. That was something littleish under this tree. Scratching around, for sure. And I don't know who it was that peed there. Because you can see that my dogs came by. Those are the bigger tracks. Mm. And uh, very snowed on tracks that went off this way. <sighs> so that would have been something that came by earlier in the night because it was snowing kind of steadily most of the night. That's why the tracks are so indistinct. That and like this is fluffy snow. It's not um, it's not coasty snow, so it doesn't hold prints very well. So yeah, looks like someone slept under here for a little bit. Uh, probably came from the back field. And then got chased off by the dogs. Let's go look over this. Hmm. There's definitely a bunch of wandering around back there. And now let's follow the tracks the other way. So I don't think they went very far the other way. Honestly. Here, these kind of end at the path. So maybe that was the cat coming in. But these ones here come off this way. That is running. Running, running, running. Oh, and then we're going to be a mess here. Let's see if anything actually went through the fence. Everyone got new straw last night. It wasn't particularly cold, but everyone likes clean sheets. Hey guys, you're in bed late. Yeah, I've had them pumpkins so far this morning, but not uh, grain. So if they're really hungry, they can start snacking. If they're not really hungry, they can just wait a couple minutes until I'm done with all this. Hmm. There were uh, geese under here. Uh, these are raven tracks here. So the ravens land and then kind of hop around a bit and then go away again. Something came this way. Looked at the fence. Did not go through the fence. Went back that way. Could have even been a dog at this point. The Tracks are so indistinct. Hmm. Well, for sure a weasel, probably a little fox or coyote uh, that was sleeping under that one tree. And who knows what I would find if I were to go into the back, except that the wind may have blown over those tracks a bit. Anyhow, always interesting in the morning. The snow really lets you go know what's going on. You have a good weekend. Keep warm. Oh goodness, that's pretty.
the sun just hitting the tips of those trees as it comes up. Quite a nice morning.